And hi, I am now holding two hand sanitizers with different concentration. This one is with 35% of alcohol and the other one is with 70% of alcohol. So, the similarity with these two is they both serve as antibacterial, but what is the difference? Yes, the difference between these two is the concentration of ethanol present in each of them, which this hand sanitizer contains 70% of ethanol, which have higher concentration in compared to the 35% of alcohol. Hi, welcome back to Siri Pencara Kimia Awal. In this video, we are going to learn ways to measure concentration. There are five ways to measure concentration of a solution. Previously, about molarity and molarity. In this video, we will look into mole fraction, percentage by mass, and percentage by volume. Mole fraction is the number of mole of substance over total number of mole of all components in the solution. So let us now move to the question. What is the mole fraction of ethanol if a solution is formed from mixing 200 gram of ethanol with 150 gram of water? So first, let us look into the formula. The formula is mole fraction of ethanol, which can be symbolized by chi ethanol is equal to number of mole of ethanol divided by number of mole of solution. So, your solution now is made up from ethanol, which is your solute, and water, which is your solvent. So, the number of mole solution is actually the number of mole of solute, which is the ethanol, plus number of mole of your solvent, which is the water. So, I've already calculated number of moles of ethanol is equal to mass of a molar mass. So, the mass given is 200 gram. Molar mass for ethanol, okay, so 12 times 2 plus with 5 plus with 16 plus 1. So, the number of moles of ethanol is equal to 4.345 mole. Now, so now we need to calculate the number of mole of water which is mass over molar mass of water which is 18. Okay so number of mole of water mass given for water is 150 gram and molar mass for water is 18. The number of mole of water you will get 8.333 mole. Now to get the mole fraction Let's get into the formula. Mole fraction of ethanol. Okay, number of mole of ethanol over number of mole of ethanol plus number of mole of the water. Okay, so number of mole of ethanol given. Three four five plus eight point three three three. So the answer will be zero point three four three. Percentage by mass is defined as percentage of the mass of a substance per mass of solution. Okay, determine the percentage by mass of a solution form when 0.892 gram of potassium chloride dissolved in 54.3 gram of water. So, 
which one is your solute, which one is your solvent. Yeah. So your solute will be potassium chloride. So this is your solute. What is your solvent? Water. So your solvent will be the water. Okay, so now solution will be solute plus solvent. What is the mass of KCl? So mass of KCl already given you 0.892. And what is the mass of solution? Okay, so mass of KCl given 0.892 gram. Mass of solution is the mass of KCl. 0.892 gram plus mass of your solvent which is the water which is 54.3 gram don't forget solution is consists of solvent and solute so you will get now you will put it putting it into the formula percentage of percentage by mass okay mass of KCl is 0 0.892 gram so over mass of solution 0 0.892 gram plus 54.3 gram times 100% so you will get the answer 1.61 percentage Percentage of volume is defined as percentage of the volume of a substance per volume of the solution. A 200 ml of perfume contains 28 ml of alcohol. What is the percentage by volume of alcohol in the perfume? So, percentage by volume, what is the formula? Percentage volume is equal to volume of your solute over volume of your solution times with 100%. So, what is your solute here? Your solute is the alcohol. Your solution is the perfume. The solution is the perfume. So just put it inside the formula. Percentage of volume is equal to the volume of solute, which is your alcohol, 28, over volume of solution, which is your perfume, which is 200 ml, okay, times with 100 the answer will be 14.